a long line of folks waiting to get inside this special sale today. You may remember seeing this story on Wednesday right here on Fox 5. Liquidator Renee Poole was called to this home after the owner died. It was filled top to bottom, inside and out, with clothes, trinkets, and decorations. Renee says about 90% of the items were brand new. It doesn't look like a dent was made, but um, we've really, we've really oh, sold a tremendous amount. Someone has to be the boss, right? I can help you. Bill at the store today. One of the heirs is with us today, and it, it sometimes makes it a little harder to have the sale when the air is on the premise because they're emotionally attached to the items. I think we can cut the price. That's a very expensive piece. Well, you know what? Pure silk and handmade. It's the last it's day of the sale, pretty... and I really do want it. I, I'm, I'm working the sale. <laughs> so this, this is our room that basically... <laughs> Okay. Um, <laughs> makes you laugh. No, this is our kind of like we call it kind of I guess our holding room. So when people bring in items, um, or okay, <laughs> we're gonna drop. I got it. Um, yeah, it's called a beekeeper, and you fill it with smoke and blow it on the bees. It sedates them so the beekeepers can get the honey out. This is cool. I mean, I was <laughs> this enamel piece back there. <laughs> that's that's oh kind of different. That's a measuring cup. It's a jug. It's huge. <laughs> what are you guys laughing about? It's it's, it's, a, it's a urinal. It's a urinal. Oh. <laughs> She was leaving, I was carrying them out, and she was crying. And now you're crying. Yeah, now I'm crying because she was crying. This is hers. Well, it's, it's hard on her because so, it's her stuff. It's her stuff, and we're setting it up, and we're going to sell it to people. And... 25 years, and I have never ever seen so much stuff. Liquidator Renee Poole was called to hold this estate sale. Records show home packed from floor to ceiling. Things like jewelry, decoration, shoes, and literally tons of clothes. Oh, yeah, and then there's the outside. The outside, oh my God. <laughs> it's taken... All right, then we got an A&W, and then we found a 50s Superstars, which is really, really cool. The Steve McQueen, who I happen to have a really big crush on. And James Dean, who oddly enough I know. I know. I just want to bring it up front to, you know. Take it. Quite remarkable that people entrust us to sell their, their, their treasures and their heirlooms for them. Um, so my mom and I work together. Um, we try to keep the business and the personal separate. We try not to talk too much personal when we're at the store. And for the most part, we get along. We agree. But sometimes I say, well, you know, I don't think. And nope, nope, this is what it is. And I'm like, well, what about, nope, nope, this is what it is. And then spurred, but sometimes I say, well, you know, I don't think. And nope, nope, this is what it is. And I'm like, well, what about, nope, nope, this is what it is. And then...